the week to vote for our 90s game of the week. Over 10,000 votes cast in week one. But Not for bad. week two, we want to raise that up a little bit, which is why preps reporter Ashley Moore joins us now in the studio with the matchups. Ashley. Absolutely. The week one race was a tight race between two matchups, but with the games we have this week, I'm sure it'll be all three. So why not start it off with a bang in a rematch of the 5A state quarterfinals. The legend Titans taking on the reigning 5A state champion, the Columbine Rebels. And this one should be a wild one at Echo Park. Columbine will have a brand new quarterback in Brennan Goodwin. When you look at that offense, it's the most pluggable and playable formation in Colorado. The offensive line is a problem, and if you let the Rebels, they'll control the game with time of possession. But legend does not stand down. Last weekend, legend faced the number three team in the state and upset them in our game of the week last year. Now, this week, Columbine is currently ranked number three, so will they do it again? Next, it's the number one 4A team in the state, the always dangerous Broomfield Eagles taking on the Monarch Coyotes. Moha heads into this matchup on a two-game win streak, winning by an average of two touchdowns. But Broomfield is coming off a dominant 24-point win over Frederick, posting over 500 total yards in offense. The last time these two played was September of 2021. Broomfield left with a 28-7 win. And last but not least, it's a top five matchup. The number one team in the state, the Holy Family Tigers, taking on the Roosevelt Rough Riders. Now this game actually won our week four game of the week last year, and we brought it back because it did not disappoint. A rivalry game in Johnstown as the reigning state champion Holy Family Tigers try to beat a rough Roosevelt team who has handed them a loss every season for the past three seasons. Both teams desperately want this win, but only one will prevail, leaving the other with their first loss of the season. But there you have it, all three matchups, and you can vote starting right now at 9news.com slash HSS. Voting closes at 10 a.m. this Thursday, and you can now vote every 12 hours. Vote for your team. 10,000 votes in week one. That's, That's pretty good. How does that like match up with what we had last year? Uh, we had a few 25,000. Oh, 25, okay, guy, we can yeah. do a little better than this. So this week, I, I think we're going to reach there a, a little close because we got some pretty good matchups this week. Just Let's revving see. up. It's just week two. <laughs> right. Got it. All right, Ashley. Thank you. Keep the you. votes coming in.